What is going on guys and girls? My name is James and welcome back today to Roblox. How are we doing everyone? Welcome back, welcome back. Today we are going to jump into the bees history once again to continue on with our adventure here in this excellent bee swarm style simulator. Today, as you can see, we are still green and in the previous episode we did a bit of a whoopsie. And you know what? It's a tale as old as time. The story is very simple. Boy meets caterpillar. Caterpillar befriends boy. Caterpillar gives various quests to boy. Boy completes quests. Caterpillar rewards boy with the gift of oil. <laughs> now, I don't know if you remember this bit, but he gave us oil and I was like, oil, that's a terrible gift, but you know what, we're gonna roll with it. Apparently I did a whoopsie. <laughs> very, very simply, all I needed to do was go into my inventory, actually look at my oil, and you see there it says, use the oil on your scythe to enter a new location. Lads, <laughs> the oil is magic. But just before we get stuck in with today's episode here, how are we all doing? Welcome back, hopefully you are all doing amazing. Uh, yeah, we're jumping back into the bees history again. So I think this is now episode three. Um, and this is a really, really fun game as I keep saying, but obviously we're still waiting for Beesmas. So in case you're kind of curious about any Beesmas news, the answer is as of right this very second, there is no Beesmas news actually. Um, there is one thing that I did see, and I, I do have access to, like, on its super secret development world. And as of the 4th of December, that world was, like, updated to have, like, the Beesmus snow map and stuff. And, like, the NPCs are back. But there's nothing really much to see right now, so I didn't really do it in a video. I'm not even entirely sure I'm supposed to be snooping around in there. <laughs> but yeah, he is currently working on Beesmus. But in the meantime, we have this game. Bees history. It's snowy here. It's lovely. You sneaky caterpillar. So I guess there's no time like the present. Let's actually have a look and see what this does. So let's go and click our oil. Equip a scythe to use the oil. Okay, so we need to go to the shop and we need to get ourselves a scythe. Now, I don't think I actually bought this one initially, um, but this could be pretty big if true. Uh, there's the scythe. So purchase the scythe. Okay, so this is not as good as the collector I've got, but I guess it's all sort of part of the quest, isn't it? Which is really cool. Uh, so here's the scythe, and now let's go and click on the oil. Your scythe is now oily! Lads, we've got an oily scythe. <laughs> um, what do we do with the oily scythe? Uh, Mr. Caterpillar? Clue? Can I slay him? <laughs> Can I slay the beast? I feel like we need to click on something. Where would it be? Hmm. I mean, there's wheat at the top here, so I'm guessing maybe... Do we cut some wheat? <laughs> I don't really know. We we're gonna try and find out. This could be a really sneaky but really cool way of having a new zone. Unless it's this bit here that we couldn't get through last time. Ooh! Ah, look! Is this it? Destroy the wall with your scythe! No way! <laughs> Oh, I remember we saw this and I was like, what on earth is going on? This could be like a new zone, but I thought it was going to be like... Well, I didn't realize it was going to be this. Isn't this cool? So I'm just like beating down upon this wall. 20. 20. 19. Come on, oily scythe. Power. Speed. Efficiency. Let's go. <laughs> we are now under 10. Actually, there might be another caterpillar behind here. Could you imagine? I think there is gonna be. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Yes! Yeah! New zone! You know what? That's really cool. <laughs> what a way to unlock a new zone. Yeah! Okay, brand new area. I see radishes. I see carrots. I see a new shop. That's not a shop. Is there a new shop? Ooh, there's a dispenser up here. Okay. Okay, we don't need any just- Ah, we can use these silver stars! Okay. Or honey? Or silver stars? I don't know. Either way, we don't need them just yet. Let me go and explore. Yo, what are these? Sleaf! Woo! <laughs> oh my goodness, mate, they do loads of damage. Oh, I forgot to collect my hive! I've got no bees! <laughs> Hang on, wait. Oh, jeez, everything's all at once. Dude, okay. I think I found a new shop as well. This is exciting. Let me go and claim my hive. Whoops. Can't believe we forgot the most important bit about the whole thing. Three, two, one, claim that hive. <laughs> there we go. That's a bit better, huh? Rightio, here we go. Back again, this time equipped with bees. Where are they? Where are my bees? <laughs> there they are. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. Um, I kind of wanted to see if we can attack these. I'm going in that cave. I feel like the cave has all the secrets. Bro, these things hit surprisingly hard. What are they? 
They look really cool, though. I want to see what they drop. Maybe they drop something good. Dude, oh. <laughs> they, they hit really hard. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let me grab those. I think the secret is just keep moving. Or maybe... Rip. <laughs> Dude, they hit hard. Oh, jeez. I'm back here again. Okie dokies. Into the cave we go. Yo, it's a new shop. Yes. Okay, this is kind of what I was hoping for. Um, Some new... Basically, a new backpack. <laughs> I was kind of curious. I was like... Between, like... The 5 zone and the 18B zone? Surely there must be something. The answer is yes. A very, very cool looking shop. Uh, okay. So let's see what prices we have. Oh, geez. Got stock on the wall. Uh, let's go and see what kind of prices we have. Uh, how do we access it somewhere here? Ah, there we go. Perfect. So let's skip all the way to the end. So these, we can actually buy super jellies from here. Speedy boots, which we can't afford either. But uh, I'd really like those. Air belt. Oh, these things are looking cool. Okay, these are slightly out of our price range right now. These are like a million, but we'll get there. That's cool. Look at the modeling on that. <laughs> like a mushroom bag. Okay. Hmm. We want to find the most expensive porter hive. Yes, 200,000. Okay, boom. I'm getting that. Nice. Can I afford the dipper? Oh, I'm so close. Okay, I'll tell you what. Hmm. I fill up really quickly. So, you know what I'm going to do very quickly? I think I'm just going to grind up. And get enough money for this dipper. And then it'll be back. Hang on. Bear with, bear with, bear with. We also need to find a new NPC. I, I was promised a new caterpillar. Where does he live? Oh, up there? A cutscene? Are you joking? Curse you, barrier! <laughs> Bro, there's cutscenes. Okay, that's actually really cool. Scythe! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't think somehow. This tree is pretty strong. If only we had an axe. Yo! I saw an axe in the shop. Oh, I, I saw an axe. I saw an axe. I saw an axe. Okay, our plans could change. There is an axe right there. Uh, where is it? How much is the axe? There! Okay. It's 519, though. So, hmm. What do we do about that? Do we, do we grind up for that? Or... Do we get the dipper? Hmm. Either way, we need the axe. I guess it's a bit of a question. Like, I'm not entirely sure. So we could either, like, go and get the axe and then go up to that level. Or we could just, like, continue on getting the bees and unlocking the 18B zone. Provided, of course, we have the wax. So we've got 14 bees right now. And we've got... Ah, uh, yeah, see, only two. So that would only be 16. So we're still missing two. But we do have the, the NPC, which we're doing quests for. Uh, I need to go and kill some more of those little crab boys. And then that one's finished. Hmm. Either way, <laughs> there's stuff to be done. Yo, that area looks really cool. It's got like big purple things. Oh my goodness. Okay. So much to do. So much to do. Hey, I got a wax from a hidden present. Yeah, there's loads of like little hidden gifts all around the map as well, which I think is pretty fun. Um, right. I need to go and empty. So it's getting like a little bit of a trek to get back. I don't think there's a special way of getting back quicker. I think you just have to run. Um, but anyway, whilst I'm here, let me go and get some crab boys. Uh, those boots would probably help though for speed. So we need to we need to look at the boots at some point. Okay, okay, let's keep going. Okay, so what I'm thinking, and to be honest, I don't really know what the correct order to do stuff is, maybe, but I'm thinking, like, because because the axe is, like, not the most expensive thing in the shop, like, I think that's probably, like, a something to do. Like, <laughs> like I guess that's kind of the point. So I don't know whether to, like, spend my, my, my honey on, like, getting more bees to go into the 18 zone or just grinding it out for the axe. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to grind out for the axe. I do need a new collector anyway. Um... Although I still would really like to get some more bees at some point. Obviously, I think we're on, what, 14 now. Um, but we can afford some more. We can get, like, three probably straight away. But I think I've got my heart set on the big chopper. Uh, that That's what I want to get. So, yeah. I need to basically grind a little bit of honey. So what I thought I'd do is, like, just because you've got, like, this little achievement thing here where you just sort of get bits. And I thought, well, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll just work on some of the lower level fields. <laughs> so I've done banana, I've done purple, and I'm going to go and do blueberry slope now. And uh, blackberry slope even. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a few minutes. Okie dokies. So progress not too bad. I've just actually finished the ones for the grasshopper. So these are like um, uh, quests where you get like this um, fresh grass boost. Uh, is it called fresh grass? Yeah, grass freshness. <laughs> Um, so I've just finished that one, so we'll see what he has next for us. But very, very sneaky little location over here. Dun, 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 dun. There he is, Mr. Grasshooper. Okay, wow! Those stars look awesome. Hmm. 
I maybe could make use of them somehow, but not for not for now. Here, take your awards. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> oh, got some, got some tomato sauce. Lovely. Okay, here we go. Oh, you're back, huh? I made some mistakes mapping the crossroads out. I need to go look uh, after against the fields. Oh, okay. Also, these crab inches are starting to annoy me. Please defeat four of them for me. You'll do it. Bro, I just defeated six of them for you. No, I defeated eight of them for you. Okay. Well, a little bit of a quest, though. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Ooh, and there's a secret present in the log. <laughs> I knew this thing looked suspicious. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay, yeah. So in case you haven't seen it, there's a secret present in the log, lads. Fiendish. Ooh. Where are we? Wait, have I been here before? Uh, am I supposed to be up here? Maybe. <laughs> uh, anything secret? Oh, I know where we're at. Okay, so we're right at the top here. Interesting. I don't know if you're supposed to be up here or not, but I am now. Oh, yes, I am. There's a present. <laughs> okay. Well, that is a very, very sneaky one. Hopefully, it's something good. It is. Another wax, royal jelly, and 15,000 pollen. Lovely. Okay, cool. I have a weird feeling we're not supposed to technically be here because I feel like I'm sneaking into the zone that I haven't actually unlocked yet. Oh, no, it puts me back. Okay. <laughs> I was about to say, I thought I saw some apples. So maybe there's an apple field. We could probably check in the, in the thing, but we'll leave a few things for a surprise. Uh, yeah. Huh, cool. We're getting there, by the way. We're like, what, 600k we need? So we're really, really close. Right, there we go. So um, I think it was five, nine, something or other. I can't quite remember. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, every single time I, I play this game, I notice people just use this mushroom to like do the shortcut. <laughs> I feel like it would be great if the mushroom was just a bouncy mushroom. <laughs> so it would just go boing and just take you up. That would be fun. Anyway, right. So we're going to go and get this big chopper, lads, for the culture. Um, and we're going to go and chop down some trees. So... Hopefully this should work with any luck. And we want to get uh, you. There it is. Okay. Axe. We definitely need this axe. Okay. Let me check. There's no other axes here. <laughs> Mushroom scythe. Okay. So we, we, this, this better be the right axe. I swear down. Three, two, one. Boom. There we go. Uh, oh, we had to pay some potatoes and some silver stars. Good job we actually had those. Um, there it is. <laughs> okay. We've got an axe. Well, here goes nothing, I guess. Uh, three, two, one. This tree looks pretty strong. Can we chop it? Yes, we can. <laughs> okay. All right. We've done a lot of barrier breaking this episode. I feel like, I feel like this is a pretty good progress. So, what's behind the trees that somehow collapsed just as soon as we went next to them? But there was a cutscene. It was actually pretty cool. I've never seen a cutscene in a Beast One game before. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Thirty-five. 30, 25, the suspense. Are we going to find Mr. Caterpillar part two? 10, five, and go. Yeah. What's up here? What's up here? What's up here? Ooh, Pez. Ooh, who are you? Oh, wait a sec. Is this the cooking guy? Yo. Okay, okay, okay. So firstly, before we even comment. Oh. It's a thing. <laughs> he looks friendly, though. It's a weevil, a beetle weevil. Okay, all right. So here's the cooking. Like we said a long time ago, we wanted to do cooking. I can't cook any of these things right now, so we need to keep saving up. Uh, but we can make mega pizzas. Wow. Oh, we can cook some orange flower tea. Increases the collection of purple pollen. So this is basically like a fancy version of the blender, I guess. Um, and these are all going to be buffs. So, let's just, I don't know. Hopefully these are not going to be part of a quest. I tell you what, I think we'll wait. Just in case someone says, cook some things for a quest. But, there's a gift here. Okay, I need the key for that one. Oh, wow. Hey, look at this. And you get an amazing view of the entire map. It's actually really big. And we still haven't even finished the zones yet. Wow. Cool. Okay. Nice. And there's another field up here. Like some kind of purple mushroom field or something. Interesting. So I swear there was like talk of another caterpillar, but maybe he's in the um, maybe he's in the 18B zone. So right now what we can do is because we've got this unlocked, which is great, we can now focus on basically just trying to get ourselves some more bees. So I tell you what we'll do. Let's uh, let's just grab a couple more things and let's maybe just 
get two or three more bees? I've got some of this stuff. Um, where is it? I've got... Yeah, I've got four more super jelly. So technically, we might be able to get some cool things. We actually have here, by the way. Uh, you have like a bee index thing. Um, so it's pretty cool because you can see like what you have and what you don't have. And then you also click on it and it gives you all the abilities and various things. So for example, uh, the cherry bee here, its ability is the cherry bomb, uh, which just explode. Really cool. Uh, but you can also see um, which ones we don't have. And there's quite a few here at the end. So yeah, cool. Right. Hang on, bear with. Let me uh, grab a few backpacks. Here's the cherry bombs, by the way. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> They're cool. So as well as the um, wax, we are also going to have to buy... What is that? Yo, wait. What it, What? It, what are you? Hang on. It doesn't let me... Hang on. Oh, no, it does let me. I'm just not doing it right. Silver egg. When used, you can get a random two-star bee or three-star bee. Yo, when did we get that? I don't remember. <laughs> Either way, let's actually pop another... Um, uh, let's pop another hive there. Let's use this silver egg, huh? Let's see what we get. And... Sugar bee! Okay, we've already got like a, a sugar bee already. I, I don't really know what the meta is right now with what bees are best, so I'm just kind of going with one of each for now, uh, more or less, and just seeing sort of what happens. Uh, but what we'll do is let's use one of our super jellies. Another marshmallow bee? <laughs> Alright, you know what, fine. <laughs> I'll take it, I'll take it. Okay, and to finish off here, we have one more for the road. Boom! And then we're gonna go and whack this little eggy in. Boom! Oh! We got a plant bee! Yo, from a basic egg? A night suit. Oh, that's a marshmallow bee. Okay, so let me click on this. Plant bee! Okay, a weatherless epic. <laughs> okay, so I guess we can. Does he have a cool ability? Either way, pretty cool to get a new one. Uh, plant bee. What's his ability? Uh, okay, so he's a white boost. Oh, fun. Okay, nice. Well, there we go. So, unfortunately, I think that's going to be about it for this episode here today. But progress has been swift. Next time, uh, we'll go and unlock the 18B zone. We'll go and see what's cracking in there. And, uh, yeah, until then, I'll see you. I'll see you next time. Thanks. And see you.